What's up guys, it's Tommy here. Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're gonna be reviewing the Zomo battery case for the iPhone XS Max. Although I'll be reviewing this battery case for the iPhone XS Max, this case is also available for older iPhones as well. This is my first battery case I've ever used, so I wasn't exactly sure what to expect. My first impressions were that the case is a bit thicker and heavier than cases I've used in the past. However, I quickly realized that's exactly what you can expect with any battery case. After a couple days of use, the size and weight of the case wasn't a big deal considering the amazing battery advantages it provides. The case has a 4000 milliamp battery that should double the battery life of your iPhone. I put the Zomo battery case to the test by letting my iPhone completely die and letting the case bring it back to life. It went from 0 to 70% in 2 hours time and the case still had more juice to give. Putting your phone in the case is very simple. You'll notice the light connector on the bottom of the case. Make sure to clean your device before attempting to insert your phone. Once you have, all you need to do is slide your phone in starting from the top. Taking off the case is also very easy. Simply remove the top of the case then slide the phone upwards. Never pull the phone straight out. When it comes to the design of the case, it looks really nice and sleek. Zomo advertises the design of the case as a sophisticated look and I'd have to agree. The case is very smooth, stylish, and looks amazing all around. The battery case does attract smudges, however a soft cloth will make the case look brand new. The power and volume buttons are easy to press and the vibrate switch isn't too difficult to get to either. On the bottom of the case, you'll see a lightning port to charge the case with a lightning cable. If your phone is in the case while charging, your phone will charge to full battery before the case begins to charge. Charging your phone with the case is very easy. You'll notice a button on the back of the case. All you have to do is press and hold the button for 3 seconds and your phone will start charging. You'll notice white LED lights turn on. Each lit up LED light represents 25% battery life left in the case. So if all 4 LED lights are on, that'll mean your battery case is fully charged. If you want to stop charging, press and hold the button for an additional 3 seconds and it'll stop. One thing I would change about the case is the thickness of the bezels. The bezels are ridged, but not as much as I'd like. Nonetheless, if I were to drop my phone, I'm confident it would still be protected by the bezels it does have. You can also lay your phone face down with no worry about scratching your screen as the bezels are large enough to prevent your screen from touching the surface. I have to admit, the small bezels does give the overall appearance a cleaner look. My final thoughts on the Zomo battery case would simply be that it's an amazing battery case for those who need it, which is most people for one reason or another. The case is stylish and does exactly what it's supposed to do. Although my phone usually lasts me a full day before before needing to recharge, I'll definitely be using this case if I forget to or I'm unable to charge my phone the night before, which does happen more often than you'd think. I'll also be bringing the Zomo battery case with me on any trips I go on. I can see it being extremely useful at amusement parks and similar outdoor events. All in all, if you're constantly having to recharge your iPhone or if you just get anxious when you see your phone getting close to dying, this case may be for you. Or you may also be like me and see yourself in certain situations where this case comes in clutch. If you're interested in picking up a Zomo battery case for yourself or someone else, I'll go ahead and leave a link in the description below. Let me know your thoughts in the comments and feel free to leave any questions as well. Subscribe to the channel for future videos. Other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.